Welcome to Starbase Pink. This is your daily space and SpaceX news. Falcon 9 rocket launched today from Space Launch Complex 4, carrying 51 Starlink satellites. This is liftoff. And liftoff of Starlink Group 2-5. Go Falcon, go Starlink. Stage separation and second stage engine ignition. And we have fairing separation. Falcon 9 first stage landing on of course I still love you drone ship for the seventh time. It was the ninth launch and landing for booster 1063. This morning got star based only two on chopsticks arms moved up and the chip quick disconnect arm moved too. And later we saw spin prime test. It looks like it was one engine spin prime test. Maybe it's the engine that Elon told us didn't ignite the last time during static fire test. The one that stopped itself, not the other one turned off by the team. All thanks to La Padre, as always, for the live footage. Three Raptor engines arrived today to Starbase, captured by Starship Gazer. We are talking here about Raptor 193, 195 and 198. PLD Space Team working on the launch pad located near Mazagon, Spain. In preparation to launch Miura 1 rocket next month, Miura 1 is 12 meter one stage suborbital rocket, passed already all the steps needed for the first launch attempt, including full duration of fire tests 5 months ago. And Miura 1 rocket is the first step for PLD space, preparation for their next orbital rocket, Miura 5, a 29 meter rocket, the first stage is powered by 5 tier per C engines. The rocket is capable of sending 900 kg to low Earth orbit with a plan to use a parachute to recover the first stage. Plan to launch next year. I will keep an eye on this company. Ryan Hansen Space shared this amazing 3D animation, a sort of prediction about what the orbital launch mount will look like in the near future after completing the shielding operations. Let's not forget that the first orbital launch mount on Starbase is working prototype, not final design, and the team will need some light in there to work inside that tunnel. This morning we saw the first launch attempt for Japan's H3 launch vehicle. This is liftoff. Main engine start. And nope, no liftoff for today. Mission abort, but we heard a loud sound coming from the launch pod. Let's hear it. Let's end this video with some new pictures from Mars, captured as always by NASA's Perseverance Mars rover. That's it for now, this is the end of this episode, see you tomorrow.